Hello everyone, in this video we are going to see how to import CSV file into Excel with few simple steps. So this Excel has already given an option to import CSV file directly into Excel. So you don't need to go to CSV file, open the CSV file, copy and come back again to Excel and paste it. So this is a tedious uh, process and you no need to do that. So all you need to do is if you want to import a CSV file into Excel, you have to go to the data tab and click on from text. So CSV is a kind of text file. So you can choose the option from text and the abbreviation for CSV is a comma separated value. So you have to click this from text and go to the CSV location. This is the CSV that I want to import into this Excel. So I'm just selecting this CSV and click on import. So you can import the CSV data in two ways. One is a delimited and one is a fixed width. So if it is a fixed width, it will separated by spaces. If you select the delimited, then you have to give the special character that you want to separate. For example, in CSV, the most common delimiter is comma. So you can see that this comma become a single cell. Item ID goes to a single cell and custom label will go to a single cell since it is separated by comma. So I'm going with comma as an option and you can also specify from which row it will import. Start import at row 1 means it will import at A1. If you give, a, if you give 2 and it will import at A2. So I'm just clicking on the next. So now it will ask the delimiters whether you uh, use this a tab or semicolon or comma or if you want to give some other let's say and any special characters like hash, dollar or any other you can specify that as here. So but I want to separate this with comma since it's a CSV. It's a comma separated value it was separated with comma so i selected the option comma and you can see the preview here this is the preview of uh, your csv file so it looks how i want it so i i selected the comma and click on next and here you can specify the format what is the format that that it should be displayed in the excel so i'm going with the general and click on finish where do you want to put the data click on a1 that's it so this data from the csv get imported here and it's very simple this is how you can import csv file into excel if you like this video give thumbs up and if you have any queries or comments or doubts just drop all your queries comments in the description section and thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye